Hey, I'm up here. Okay, so a little bit more. Another update. Sorry about that. That I didn't get one. I guess now it's two days ago or three days ago when you get this video. Um, that was because of stuff happening. Um, anyway, so stuff I've done. Uh, you probably notice all this stuff around the sides now that I've pointed it out. Um, that's all the control sections for turning on and off loop because obviously when you finish it, you're gonna have to be able to turn it off. But if you're playing with, let's say I don't know, 87 and a half people. Then you're gonna have to, uh, you know, turn it off at different exits, or one person doesn't want to turn it off because you know there's other people there. So the last person wants to turn it off. So that's that's all that is. Um, what you call? What else have I done? Oh right. Uh, so the third exit. So right, when you start. I don't think I've explained this at all. When you start the map, there's three choices. Uh, the first two are kind of the ones that I've ever covered. The third one finally has its little railway that's gonna go to this last section that I've set aside for it and that's gonna be about two floors or maybe even three I'm not sure yet so that's what that's going to be I'm gonna have to surround the entire place in cobblestone so you don't see this massive redstone because they don't want you to see that massive redstone this parts all meta and stuff so it's a it's okay if you see the redstone the last thing is I've built a near not quite exit place but it's I think it's a place right uh, let's break through um, right here and that's just going to be, not the ending, but it's the other option instead of going to this mob spawn thing. Um, and the other exit will be breaking through here. Or, we choose this, this part three. And then down here, which is the part I like more, because it's more fun. Um, I'm thinking that's all I did, so bye. That's pretty good.